Good day to you, my friends. Ban the import of Chinese products for animals in America. Look, I am hugely a big lover of animals of all kinds. Dogs, cats, you name it. It has just come out that beef jerky from China may have killed as many as 600 dogs and cats in the United States of America. We have three dogs as of today. Two beautiful hound dogs and another little beautiful Bichon. Within the past two years we have lost two hound dogs and a beautiful Bichon to cancer. I will be damned if I'm going to lose another animal that I love so much because of crap that the Chinese government makes and ships to the United States of America. It was not that long ago that baby formula from China was killing babies right here in America. Why does our federal government allow such crap to be imported into our country from China or any other crap hole country on the planet? Are the politicians paid off in advance? Mm -hmm. I have done some research on the beef jerky scandal. It would appear that the inspectors in the FDA did back down from Chinese importers of the contaminated dog beef jerky. They did not want to offend the poor lowly little Chinese. China made a threat if the imported crap Get up, Get was up. not approved and the Obama government did not back down to worlds. their Chinese manufacturers that they would retaliate. Folks, I can't stand kiss assers and I will Get not abide block. by or accept kiss assers. Come on, I'm Valentine. sorry. Go get but her, every dog, cat, Go and animal that we have, had, have come him. before any of these get dickheads it. in Washington, D.C., or Beijing, Ooh. China. Blossom. If the product does not clearly state and is 100% made in What's the United it? States of America, then I refuse to buy it from now on. I will be looking for made in the United States of America label until the day I die and then after. And so should you.